And that's my face, that's my face. And that's a naked person. I need a spice girl. Zigga, zigga, I fuck up my whole world. Tell her what I want, what I really, really want is a spice girl. I do my own videos because it's basically just like my audition tape in a way for bigger things. A couple of the scenes in this video, like I had these ideas in my phone for these scenes, not for the Spice Girls video, but just for videos in general, things I wanted to do in videos. So I knew I always wanted to put like my face on a foot and I always knew I wanted to put my face on a girl's face together with me. Girl, scary and sporty. Tell her what I want, what I really, really want. We made sure like everyone was off set. You know, like I, if you look at my videos, it isn't like girls shaking their asses or anything like that. And I told her, hey, like your face is not gonna be in this. Just how you know, and she's like really cool with it. So these two are my best friends, Yosef and Jonathan. They're running on treadmills. That's a green screen behind us with a shitty background. I wanted the background to look shitty on purpose. So right here is the blue toilet from the album cover. And then this is basically just handlebars to a motorcycle. So I just basically wanted to make a motorcycle toilet. The treadmills are at the bottom. You can't see it on screen on purpose. The handlebars are connected to this like wooden platform the set designer made. Clayton was amazing. Clayton got this shit done in like a day and a half and built this whole set. He's like the MVP of this video because he built this shit. Always in your prime, other women don't align. And when I'm off work, then you know it's bedtime, so let's go. I was pissed. I was so pissed during the scene. So this is like the last scene we shot of the day. Shot this whole video in a day. It was like a, I don't know, 16 hour day. Jonathan, my friend, sprayed this lotion on my face on accident. Like right here, I'm smiling and laughing, but two seconds later, I was just like mad. Clayton built this big ass lotion bottle. Um, it's seven feet tall. I had to be taller than me. And I'm like, just for the ladies. I'm six feet one. CLBN is my clothing brand. Club Banana is just like what we rep and just fans fuck with it, I guess. It is an actual lotion. It's this gelatin that Clayton built that's reminiscent of um, lotion. It's, I think it's basically like conditioner. I'm aggressively rubbing this lotion, so we had to like, somebody had to come and wipe me down with a towel and then we'd redo the scene. This pink wall is an actual pink wall. This whole side right here, this is completely fake. Mistakenly, since we only had a day to do this video, the wall only fit this side, this much of the screen. Amazing After Effects people took the, like a section of these walls and we filmed them and then cut and paste them to put here behind Jonathan's leg and they added these shadows there. Like when they weaving, I never listen. Issa Rae, she's amazing, great person. So before, when I was writing this treatment, she um, tweeted about her listening to my album. So I thought that was really, really, really cool. I just like followed her on Twitter. She followed me back and then I DM'd her like, hey, I'm making a video for Spice Girl. Would you like to be in a scene? She was like really kind and nice and genuine, really read the treatment and made sure things were, she was cool with every scene and she was and she just showed up to set and killed it and rocked like my custom, like Amine merch, the Spice Girl shirt that I made and like, Look like my baby mama had a fake baby and she this is all her acting. This is just her being like natural. Scary and sporty. Tell her what I want, what I really So basically we had a bunch of um, assistants on set who basically got this shit done. That's a custom stamp we made for good for you to put on these sticky notes. This whole scene is a reference to Bruce Almighty. It's like one of my favorite films. And there's a scene of Jim Carrey like covered in sticky notes. So yeah, it's just a reference in an old tune. My girl's a spice girl. Her words in my world. And most of all, she's fine to me. In the light. This is basically in slow motion. We do it twice as fast so we can slow it down in post. And it can and you and my mouth like fits the song. So I was rapping the song pretty fast. So I was like, my girl's a spice girl. Her world. I was doing like really fast. It was really not fun to say, but ended up looking like way better. This whole scene is another reference. This is the Rolling Stone cover um, from a few years back of Johnny Knoxville. He has a Rolling Stone cover. If you look closely, it's red and white of him on a bullseye getting shot with red paintballs. And I wanted to just basically copy it and just do um, 
a yellow and blue version. Honey, you're doing it all wrong. So basically I had the script, this whole skit written for, for us. And we didn't have much time to rehearse it because she's a busy woman as well. So like I got, I got to meet her for the first time days before at like some party, I ran into her and it was, she was the most nice person. I told her about this video I'm doing and like, would you want to be on it? I told her, I got to ask her in person, which is so much better than an email or a text, you know? So I told her about it and she was like, hell yeah. She actually came. I didn't think she'd actually come. I thought she was just going to flake out on us, but she actually came and it was cool. <laughs> so I had a script written for her to read on set, but it didn't, it wasn't, it didn't turn out. I didn't like it for, for, for me because it didn't turn out to what I thought it was going to be. I basically just took all her bloopers from that skit that we did and had her just cuss me out multiple times. <laughs> this isn't her like acting, you know, this is her like really fucking up, you know, when she's like, ah, oh, I can't say freaking, you know, that's like her really being herself. So these are actual bloopers in the video. That's the sticky note scene right here, if you look closely in the background. And this is like the assistants right here in this area. Uh, working on the sticky notes and putting them on the wall. I wanted them to just watch this and be like, what the fuck is that? And then be like, I gotta see this again. I need a spice girl. And I forgot to lotion up my lips, put some lip balm on. See those crusts? Forgot that. We for yeah, yep, yeah, that's where we fucked up. <laughs>